Oh boy, there's a train coming. Gotta run! Run! I'm not gonna make it. Somebody help me! Alrighty. What's up everyone? Uh, Red Tux here with another video. I want to talk to you about glitches today. And I guess I feel more compelled to do this video now than I did before. Because um, there were a couple glitches I knew about before. But now I know pretty much the main ones. If I'm missing some, you know, let me know in the comments. I know this game probably has... Uh, seems like this game has more glitch problems than the older versions did, like Wild World or City Folk, which is surprising, because most sequels to games, you know, they kind of have stuff fixed in them. Um, but I don't know, there's some weird stuff going on, I want to show you and tell you about that stuff, so let's get right to it. Okay, so a couple months after this game was released in Japan, I guess a couple months, I want to say it was a couple months. Uh, someone found out about the tweeter glitch and the tweeter glitch uh, first off you would have to have the item itself a tweeter and you would get this through street pass uh, and it was kind of random you know you can get a lot of different things through street pass it could be a balloon it could be a ice cream cone whatever but if it's a tweeter you can use the tweeter to clip through walls and this is pretty cool so basically if you have the tweeter let's just pretend I had one uh, and I'm holding it in my hand right now uh, some dude walks through my gate and I'm like, hey, can you, can you just kind of push me while I do this? So, anyway, all I would have to do is keep tapping A while a player is pushing me. And eventually, it would push me past this block and I'd be able to walk around the railroad or whatever. So, that was the original way to clip through stuff. And you could do this anywhere. You could climb buildings like this. Like, if you clip through this, uh, wall right here on the cafe, you would end up on top of the cafe. Um, so that's the tweeter. Let's talk about the, the pharaoh mask glitch. So I found this on YouTube, uh, as well. Can't remember who posted it. There's probably multiple people that posted it now. But there are certain spots in each town where you can dig holes in a weird way. Let me, let me see if I can show you, uh, an example real quick. There is, down here I have, this is where my spot is in my town. Oop. <laughs> Just drop the snowball. Okay. So you're going to dig like this. And you can't just go in here and dig a hole. You've got to dig a hole. And then you've got to bury an item first. For some reason, it's like the game wants you to dig this up. Or dig up anything. Because if, if I stood here and tried to dig without something in the floor, I would just... I wouldn't even be able to do it. It would it would act like I was hitting this pattern and that just would not dig a hole at all. So now that I've got something in the in the ground, I can just dig and I'll pick it up and my character will stop bobbing around like this. And you would think doing this on its own would actually get you down to the beach. And I don't know, there's probably a way of... I don't know. I would say there's some chance of doing that, but... While you're doing that, you need to have a pharaoh's mask. Because if you're wearing a pharaoh's mask, you can trip. And when you trip, when you're bobbing like that, it will send you down. Like, definitely. Um, another way you could do that is if you didn't have a pharaoh's mask, but you got, like, bad luck from Katrina, and you were tripping one day, uh, you could do it that way, too. Um, okay, so now I want to show you something crazy and something very simple that doesn't require a tweeter or a pharaoh's mask. And it's, you can do this by yourself. All you need is a net. And I saw this video, like, yesterday, and I think the first video I saw about it was, I mean, the earliest, uh, <laughs> what am I trying to say? The video furthest back was, like, of doing of someone doing this was like November of 2013 so it's it seems like it's fairly recent but all you need is a net um, it's probably been known for a while I'm not sure but all you do is okay so the net in the older games you would just press a and that's all you could do you could swing this thing and that's that's pretty much all you could do to catch bugs 
In this game, you can sneak up on bugs, which is kind of neat, and it works pretty well. Well, something's up, because now, if you go up to a wall and slightly hold up on your joystick or circle pad, I mean, you see me clipping through the wall like that? You have to really just slightly be holding your circle pad in the direction you want to go, and you'll go in that direction. And you have to keep it as still as you can. There have been some times where I'll actually look at my circle pad to make sure it's like straight up so I know that I'm going the right way. So now I'm on the wall and I can go on the railroad, which is pretty crazy. And the cool thing about this is you don't need another player to help you out. Uh, the Pharaoh's mask kind of was limited. You could, you could do that, but it would only really get you to the river. Um, this changes everything because you could go anywhere you wanted um i was in a dream dream town the other day and i was looking around and there was one unexplored area of the town that i could not get to and i would i would come back to this town over and over again trying to figure out ways to get there well now i know how and i <laughs> by the town by the time i actually went there to see what was on the beach it was like nothing there was like this small island in the town and there was nothing on it but it was it was cool that I could you know take the net and go wherever I wanted um, so there's a lot of glitchy stuff you can do with this so like here I'm like out of bounds uh, there's an invisible wall in front of me but if I use the net I could get past it which I'm not going to show in this video because this is just kind of explaining it um, but yeah there you go um, and <laughs> if you get hit by the train well, nothing really happens. Uh, the train will go right through you. It's, it's kind of weird. <laughs> That's something I learned by waiting on the train, which takes forever, by the way. Um, but yeah, cool stuff like that. Like, And you can take the net to Main, Main Street. For some reason, Nintendo allowed tools in Main Street. I have no idea why. I've never seen any reason to use a tool on Main Street. Um <laughs> And then they also allow them in the Happy Home Academy, so you can do a little glitching in there too. Um, but anyway, this has been some game glitching. Um, obviously, I did not find this stuff. I don't know who to credit for, for finding it. Um, I will give props to those people who found I mean, that's... I don't know how people find this stuff. I mean, I would say the best games that are out today are the ones that have the best glitches. I mean, take a game like Mario or or Zelda, Ocarina of Time. There's a speed run of Zelda that uh, someone does in like 19 minutes. Ocarina of Time beaten in 19 minutes. Is that possible? Yes, because someone glitched. Um, so, th I don't know. Glitches interest me, um, especially this one. I mean, this lets you go anywhere in the town that you want it to. That's, I mean, that's pretty neat. But anyway, thought I'd show you that real quick. Um, I guess I'll give you a little insight on what's going on with the new town while I'm here. Um, I've been working on that town like crazy. And I swear it's only going to be like a couple weeks before it's out. Uh, I basically need to place patterns. I've made everything I need to. I need to place all the patterns on the ground and then I need to fill the houses. That's it. So I have all four villagers made and everything. Uh, as far as what the town will be, I'm still going to leave that down low because it's an idea that I think is really good. I hope it's received pretty well. Hopefully it will be um, as popular as the game is and everything I'm sure it will be. So we'll see what happens and I hope you guys like it when it comes. So uh, if you like this video, hit the like button, give me a comment, subscribe, whatever. Thanks for watching. This has been Game Glitches with Red Tux. I will see you in the next video. Take care. And I just went through the train tunnel to close out my video. That is pretty epic. I will see you in the next one.